Attention please. This uploading is only for educational purpose. No intention to infringe copyrights. Learning English with subtitles. G Patrol. Follow us. Slender man starts walking through the doors. I didn't even recognize him. Where's Alex? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> walking in this time, as opposed to the first time, was great. Because the first time, I looked like a giant marshmallow with beaver hair, and that was a fail on my life. This was a triumphant return. Dude! Wow! He's got this smile on his face, and he's... He's confident, and I've never seen that before. I brought a couple things in my backpack from uh, back in the day. Oh, jeez. And the day was like nine months ago. Pull them out, let me see this. I brought a shirt that looked like somebody's blanket. Dude, how, how many X is that? Five, five whole big ones. How does it feel shopping straight off the rack? You get to walk in nice stores and have nice, nice pretty ladies help you pick out clothes, I'm okay with that. Dude. Instead Man. of going to the big and tall shop where it's all dudes, mm -hmm. that's a fail. Yeah. This is a kid that he kept his, his eyes at the ground and his shoulders hunched over. But that's, that's the beauty of this transformation. I gotta admit, this is gonna be fun. I think so too. <laughs> I'm sorry I can't stop staring at you. <laughs> it's crazy how much you've changed in the last three months. I found a swagger and I'll be darned if I'm ever giving it back. Well. When I left you at Fort Benning, you were 341 pounds. And I gave you the goal to be around 40 to 50% of your original body weight, which is at least 70 pounds. So if this scale reads 271 pounds or less, you hit your goal. All right, my friend, step on the scale. There it is. You yeah, see that? buddy. See that? Wow! That's the 200s. Wow! That's the 200s. 264 pounds. You, my friend, lost 77 pounds in phase three, which is ridiculously tough. So in the last nine months, you've lost 195 pounds. Dude, you're five pounds away from 200. You lost about 42 and a half percent. That's impressive. I definitely think my mom's proud of me. There's no doubt. I've. I'm doing what she always wanted and tried to help me do. And I know she's looking down and saying, that's, that's my boy. Well, tomorrow we're gonna go see the skin surgeon. And fingers crossed, Dr. Stoker's gonna give you his blessing. Fingers, toes, everything crossed. <laughs> Alex, hi. The skin is a problem. It's not just I want to look good with my shirt off, which I do, but it's when I go outside to exercise and I run, like there's movement that should not happen. Wow. So Alex, you've got a tremendous amount of extra skin. You know, you can see the rashes, the irritation and so on. The good news is now that you're really an incredible candidate uh, for this procedure. Nice. That's awesome. <laughs> Very excited. Good news, huh? That is Very great. Good Getting the surgery is putting the uh, final touches on this year. It's going to be amazing. Well, you ready to do this? Ready as I'll ever be. All right. This is the last stop before his final weigh in. So now's the time. Get rid of the skin and continue on your journey. We got three more months to finish this transformation, and I can't wait to see him. I'm Chris Powell. Now, y'all are here to see Alex, right? Yeah! yeah. yeah. And Alex is on his way here right now. This is the Alex that I met one short year ago, and he is a very 
Very different man today. You're, you're probably all wondering what we're doing out here on a baseball field. And this is actually a very, very special field. In fact, it was on this baseball field where, where Kim, Alex's mom, she used to come and watch her boys play baseball. And she was here every single game. And Alex, he told me that this was the last place where he felt he ever made his mom proud. Of course, if you ask Alex, he'll tell you that she's watching prouder than ever. Her last wish was to see Alex lose the weight. Tonight, Alex is going to grant his mom's last wish. Put your hands together for the brand new Alex. Now, y'all are here to see Alex, right? And Alex, he's on his way here right now. This is the Alex that I met one short year ago. And he is a very, very different man today. So, without any further ado, ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for the brand new Alex. What a difference a year makes, huh? I mean, if I can do it, Absolutely. anybody can do it. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, let's get into it. What do you say? Let's do it. All right. You guys ready? Yeah. All right. Here we go. Final win. Shoes off. You know the drill. You're 23 years old. You're not just obese, you're morbidly obese. You don't stop! Oh. Alex, your mom is watching you. She wants me to keep going. Then what are you waiting for? I can do it! Yes, you can. You're gonna have one vision, one goal. Fulfill your mission, who? Oh. Wow! I'm down 216 pounds, and that number means a new life. 216 pounds in a year? Who does that? I do that. <laughs> I've got one more surprise for you. Oh, God, here we go. This is a year of surprises. Are Commissioner? Again. Alex, this is Gwinnett County Commissioner Lassiter and she has something to give you. Alex, we are very proud of you in Gwinnett County. We have a plaque to give to you for Kim's Corner, which will be installed at this park. In honor of your mother, Kim Respice, lovingly remembered by her many friends and family for her spirit of the game and also the commitment to you. She would be very, very proud of you at this moment. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Congratulations. Thank you. Oh, God. <laughs> this really means the world to me well. because. There are times throughout this year where 
I wanted to pick up the phone, call mom, say, hey, I'm doing it. But somehow, some way, she gave me the strength to push through. And God, I wish she was here. She is. She is. She is with you. If there's one thing that I think my mom would say to me right now, she would say that she is proud of the man that I've become. Seriously, I miss her to death, but I know she's always here. I feel my mom present with me at all times, especially tonight. All she ever wanted was for me to be healthy and happy. And I'm both of those now. I love you, buddy. I love you, too. Thank you. Thank you. It's just been awesome watching you turn your life around and watching you become this amazing man that you are right now. And I'm just, I'm excited to watch and, and see the impact that you make in the world. I am. I love you, buddy. I love you too, man. <laughs>